Hello, people of the internet. I'm gonna do an unboxing video today. I got my first box from a subscriber who just wanted to send me stuff. And I got some cool stuff um, from the Pacific Northwest. I believe he's in Washington, maybe Oregon. So thank you. This is from one of my subscribers, Crawdad. And I will definitely be sending you some stuff. So he sent a letter here with it. Most specimens are labeled. I have included a few uncut Lucky Strike Thunder Eggs for when you do get your lapidary equipment. Thunder Eggs? I have people pick their Thunder Eggs and then cut them. About 25% are duds. These are small for a small saw or easier, easy hammer cracking. There are also obsidian slabs to practice napping. Ooh. Obsidian? If you haven't done it, the tool can get you started. There's also a large obsidian needle because it's weird. Blessings to each of you, Crawdad. All right, thank you. Dude, I cool. love let's, obsidian. Let's get into it here. Yeah, I don't have any minerals really from the Northwest. I so. don't have any obsidian and I love obsidian. It's weird. I'm, oh, cool. All right, this is... What's this? Okay, this must be like the napping tool to like Knock, knock the flakes off the flint. Look at this. And I guess this is, yeah, this is a piece of leather for like kind of holding it and shaping. Mm. That's cool. Okay. I'm gonna try that. Merlin, you're ruining my video. Mm -hmm. Okay, Lucky Strike Thunder Egg. Ooh, a thunder egg. What do they look oh, like? Triplet. So, oh, oh, cool, it's cut open. Oh, awesome. All right, good, good. I was nervous to break them with a hammer. What is a thunder egg? It's like a geode. Oh, oh wow. wow. Oh. These are so cool. Oh, I wish I had a thunder egg. The thunder eggs are different. They're not like the geodes we get here. I think the thunder eggs form in volcanic rock and the geodes that we get are in sedimentary. Oh, that's cool. That's beautiful. Can you see it? Merlin. Oh, cool, you can't see Don't it, but- Don't blow the rubber band. I can even see the light shining through on the back of it here, Merlin. on part of it. That's a that's beautiful stone. That's a rubber stone. band. Let's go with this one next. Oh, okay. Okay, this looks like- Obsidian? Yes, definitely. This, okay, these are cool. These are like cut. Dude, I love So you can polish them. I guess maybe these are for practice napping. See, you can get the flakes out of it there. Oh, it has a rubber band. So these are cool. These are like, this is like cheating. Start with them already cut and then knock out an arrowhead. looks like one of those geodes no deconstructed granite with sunstones sunstone i love some so yeah we don't have any sunstones I yet know. That, oh cool that one there they are are we that sunstone for that bag i think it's it, uh, feldspar they never applied. okay here's another thunder egg Dude, oh. That one's still together. Man, Another thunder egg. Another thunder egg. They got such a cool name. I think I will open one yeah, of them. Yeah, yeah, go for it. Yes. Mahogany Obsidian, Davis Creek, California. Mahogany? Oh, yeah. Oh. Thunder egg. It does Ooh. have a rich mahogany it's a nice look one. to it. It's a nice little. This is a, actually a pretty nice little thunder egg. Yeah. Yeah, they're so different than the geodes we get here, but still kind of have that botryoidal thing going. Ooh. Obsidian slabs for napping. I'm gonna have to try and do this. 
Are they comfortable like the pillows so you can sleep on them? Like the ending? I don't know. No! Flint napping, silly. I've never heard of that. <laughs> and I'm right. Yeah, I'm gonna put them under my pillow. <laughs> It's a beautiful stone, kind of dark and translucent. We have lots of flint and chert here, but no obsidian. What's this? It's like a pack bag. Oh. These, I think these are the, oh, these are the obsidian needles that he was talking about. Oh, okay. There's a lot of them. Said they make good wind chimes. Oh yeah, these are cool. Thank you, Merlin. You're so helpful. By tacking that rubber band. Cool. Nice. Yeah, these just don't break up. Man, that's that's cool. I probably am going to make wind chimes with those. These make good wind chimes as they already are. Okay. Oh, here must be like a yeah. This is a bigger piece of it. The mahogany obsidian. If you want to hold that and oh, get in on it, like, it's really pretty. Looks like a piece of an obsidian broke off this. In yeah. Well, that happens. That's good. Dude, I love obsidian. It's okay, like this one, glass. this one says hold up to light. Oh, yeah. It's basically like glass. They're pretty much clear. I don't know. They're pretty much clear. If we can get that on camera. Yeah, that's a pretty stone. Yeah. And dude, that sh mm. that's sh this shard is awesome too. Yeah, you, that shard is yours. Thank you. All right. Oh, here's another piece of it. Obsidian Pink Lady Mine, Davis Creek, Oregon. Cool. This one has that the same translucency, but it's a little thicker piece. Oh, what is it? Ooh light? What? Well, it's kind of like ooh black. Then, grr! Let's see. Ooh light. Ooh like a guide. Ooh light. Oolitic agate, Harney Lake, Oregon. Huh. I've never seen anything like that. It's like crystallized coral almost. Yeah, it's. Got little like little balls all over it. And, ooh, plume agate. Plume. I've heard of this before. What's this? It's a type of agate. Poland dot agate. So that's cool. That'll polish up pretty. Dude, that's oh, aw that's awesome. Polka dot agate. Ooh, this one is really pretty. Yeah. From Ashwood, Oregon. Okay, we need to go find it for those. I need some of those. <laughs> it's really pretty. It's got kind of a purple color to it. Yeah, it's like a heavy. What's this? It's petrified wood? Ooh, petrified wood. Warm Springs, Oregon. This is actually pretty elongated. It's cool. I always love when you can see the wood grain structure in it. We get a little bit of petrified wood in Missouri, but not much. Oh, this is a big one. Oh, uh, this is another one of those obsidian needles. The mahogany one. It's a really pretty stone. Yeah. That's a big boy. Yeah. All right. I need, I need well, I'm excited about these thunder eggs. So I'm probably gonna wait until I get a saw. I don't want to just crack them. But this is this is epic, and uh, definitely be sending you some cool stuff, Mr. Crawdad. So stay tuned. I got piles and piles out in my yard. And thank you so much. Anybody that wants to send me stuff, you can. I'll send you some stuff too. Oh wait, I forgot this thing. Let's see. Oh, what we thing? got. I forgot this. There's a whole, whole big old pile of stuff here. Oh, what's that? What's oh, that? Oregon sunstones. Sunstones. 
beach stones. I don't have any sunstones. From the Oregon coast. Oh, oh these are beautiful. Some different tumbled agates and stuff. None of us have sunstones until now. Limb cast agate. Dude, this, these are oh, so these many are, sunstones. So this is like oh. fossilized wood that got agatized. Ooh, that's cool. That's cool looking. Stone from Agate Lake, Oregon. Oh, wow. there's a wire wrap in here. Okay, sorry, Crawdad. I almost left out the best package here. Yeah, sunstones. Oh, and there's a, he even put in a little cleaning cloth for it. Oh, he's very All excited. right, well, Ashley, I think this is for you. This is beautiful. <sighs> Oh, whoa. wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, thank you so can, much. Can I take a good look at that? That's beautiful. Dude, that's wow. a... Dude, that, that's right. beautiful. Agate nodules. Cool. Wow. From near Burns, Oregon. Near Burns? Was it on fire there lately? But no. Tumbled... Yadenite. Never heard of that. Looks like some kind of jasper. Sounds like it's cool yodel. looking. <laughs> and sea maggot, Lake Creek, Oregon. Okay. All right. Sorry, I almost left out the best part. Thank you so much. I'm gonna super hook you up with some awesome Missouri lace agate. And stay tuned. Um, I was hanging out with the Crystal Collector last week digging stuff. So that video is coming up soon. Um, that got a little crazy. I don't know how Brian ever even manages to edit videos and put them out. So, all right, thank you. <laughs> what?